Myself, man, like, I'm not that guy. Here with. Precious. And me in it. So today was it. Oh, my question is, uh, first for Precious, what is the difference between African guys and West Indian guys? What is the main difference? The difference? So you could say, as a friend, what was the, the difference? Because everybody tries to say we're the same, but we're all a bit different in it. Much different to be honest. Oh. I think so. No, I just say culture wise, possibly. Go on. But that's about it. Go I say, on. like, in terms of possibly different foods, that's about it. I don't really think there's much difference. But, like, what do you think? Do you agree with that? Disagree? I don't agree at all. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Why don't you agree? So you could do like a, a spider diagram about, like, how different we are. Yeah. How different are you? Like, they both like bright colours, but Africans would have brighter colours. Like, we would have like a mm. orange or a yellow. No, yeah. like a green. And the Africans would have like a pink or a, a yellow. Like, they got to be that, <laughs> that bit more. Arguing, you know, Caribbeans was cuss in their language. Mm. An African person who is not directly from their country mm. like, you know they've been over here a bit they know English mm. they got a shout from the phone I think so do Caribbean people though but that's no, in their no, that's no, in no. their pattern though they're, they're, they're passionate about it, but they're shouting in English the same thing with and you know, what is, and you know what is yeah half the time yeah they're not even angry at least if a, a Caribbean person is <laughs> cussing yeah you know that they're angry innit? you know that's what they say when they're saying it mm. an African person would be like yo I left the keys in the house but obviously they don't say it like that no, I don't agree. No. I think Caribbean people do that as well, though. No, no, no. I think no, no, when no. they're talking, sometimes Mm-mm. they can get a bit loud, and it's just like, what's happening no, over that's, there? But no, that's just, yardies. That's different. There you go. That's, that's Caribbean, yardies. Though. That's different. That's different. <laughs> they're like a, 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 a. But then again, you can't really say a that small about majority. They can both no. cook. Can both dance. Like, there's a lot of similarities. No, again. Mm. Culture wise, I'm still gonna say, but culture wise, it's not in a Caribbean person's culture mm. to like shag someone when it comes to like money and stuff like that. Yeah, <laughs> it's all about Nigerians. Let's be oh, <sighs> don't send for me, people. But I'm caught a Nigerian anyway, so I can kind of say this. You're sending you know, for yourself, way, it's all right. But I know that's the stereotype that they've got, isn't it? Because people then actually say, but I don't think that's true. I think also Caribbeans are like that. But with money. If anything, yeah, we're yeah. stingy. We're not. We wouldn't con you, like. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we wouldn't do that. We wouldn't con you. We wouldn't I con don't know. you. Mm, I think, yeah, you guys can con still. No, 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 no. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> All right, fine. I put my hands up. I can say Nigerian people. The bad breed Unfortunate ones. that that's the stereotype that they have. Four one nine, in it. Oh my Which god. Which I don't agree with, but not every Nigerian is. Of course not. Of course not. And that's just one percent of like Africa. What about the rest of them? Yeah, but we don't really get to see the rest of them in the bits, though. They're not really. They're not loud. That's why they're quite quiet. Listen. Unlike Caribbeans, who we'll know where they are. They're Listen, we we owed that shit. Thank they you very go. much. They're loud. Yeah, you better know. We you better recognize. Like, yeah. yeah. We're not all that loud. We're not that loud. <laughs> <laughs> Say if you mean it, innit? <laughs> like you dating like an African girl or a Caribbean girl, like what, what has... Been... Does it work or does it not work? Yeah, or what has been the notable differences? Africans are rough. <laughs> 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 I don't agree with that. What do you mean rough? Think... Yeah, maybe, maybe it's just like down to bad experience. Obviously, they're just rough, man. See a Caribbean girl, yeah? They're, not, they're normally like rowdy, if that's a word to use. That's true. When... Mm-hmm. They're upset, or the boyfriend is not listening, the partner's not listening, is it? Mm-hmm. Uh, I don't know. Have you dated an African girl? Yeah. What did you Nigeria. get from that? Oh, God. Um, I mean... She was alright, but actually she wasn't alright. I actually drew attention to myself with Nigerians. Really? Yeah. So all of the Nigerians in the comments below, innit? All that man like... <laughs> <laughs> Come on, be honest. Nobody's going to be offended, innit? Okay, cool. Again, I would say culture. Culture wise, they've got different beliefs, and I don't know if beliefs is the right word, but it's, yeah, it's a bit harder to deal with mm-hmm. somebody that is, because I'm African, mm-hmm. African, that's Caribbean. Mm-hmm. 
and if they're not willing to adjust or shall I say compromise mm -hmm. because also Africans have their beliefs mm. and you get some Caribbean people that are in like stuck in their beliefs as well it's yeah that sounds like me that, like one person I was like hmm yeah that sounds like me unless I feel like from when if you've dated a person from young it's much easier for you to kind of grow up together so you think it's easier to date an African because he's gonna pretty much know where you're coming from basically oh. unless like I said if the person's willing to compromise and but then again it could be anyone it might not just be African and Caribbean it could mm. also be Asians and European people and so on I'm just saying that I'd need my like rice and peas. So, <laughs> but you can teach the person to make it. No, nah, it's not the same. It it's not the same. It's not the same. It's not the same. You know. It's like us, isn't it? The same yeah. And, and it's not even about like mm. what race you are, or whatever, because right? it's just it's not the same, isn't it? I'm sure there's like Jamaican Chinese women that cook some of the baddest like flipping rice and peas <laughs> on the planet. So, yeah. I wonder if like um, language plays a part to do with it. Seeing as we don't really, unless you're like French Caribbean, you don't really speak another language, do you? Yeah. Because broken English is not another that language. That, yeah. It's just broken English. I think so. I think language does play a part as well. Mm. That's why I think like culture and language. Yeah. You're going to feel left out, isn't it? And plus food, I still think Caribbean food is like the best ever. I don't believe so, but you know what? Boy! <laughs> Food's the best, but you know. He doesn't like a bit of jerk, innit? That is the question. Oh, who doesn't like a bit of jollof, innit? Me, because I've never had it. So. <laughs> That's never had it. But who doesn't like a bit of jollof with plantain? With <laughs> a what? Planting. What, planting? Plantain. Yeah, with planting, yeah. That is mad. Just planting. Let, let it go. <laughs> it, is, it is weird, innit? Because we all basically eat yam and green banana and all that, all that stuff, but it's completely different. Yeah. Yes. It's so different. You said that with passion. Yes. Like even, you know what it is? Even to the point where if you was to walk into a West Indian house, an African house with a blindfold on, you yeah. could, from the cooking, you could smell, yeah. you, you would know. Yeah, you would know. Not even from like... You'd know the difference. Mm. Yeah. By the way it was cooked. Mm -hmm. mm. But it was the same ingredients. It could have been the exact same yeah, ingredients. that's true. Because like you guys have curries as well, right? Or not really. Curries, it's more like a, it's more like a stew. stew. Yeah. Well, we have stews as well, isn't it? But your stew would be like a soup, innit? With like dumplings and stuff inside. That's what you could be. See, with us, it's a bit thicker. It's more thicker. Oh. It's like more tomato based. No, I'm not that. Whereas our soups that just... you call stews would be a soup. Let me just hold my rice in peace. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, don't knock it till you've tried it, okay? Right. Malak, any final thoughts? But they don't like each other though, innit? It's, it's just out there. There is, you know what it is? It's just that background, that's that backstory, innit? They just don't like each other though. You know what? I think it's a bit of a frenemy thing, innit? <laughs> they love but hate at the same yeah, time. It's like it's, yeah, it's like everything's alright until. It is, yeah. They, 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 we want to be like cool here, yeah, but. Nah. Mm. It's a Hitler thing, like. They won't let it go, innit? It's not letting it go, innit? It? Everybody's like cool, but nah. I remember one of the most messed up things I ever heard. I was like, oh my God, I was in my feelings about this. She was like, oh, you always say these things about African people. I was like, no. Like, it's just observations. It's not that deep. And she's like, ah, oh, I don't know what you're talking about. Like, you guys are a bunch of lost people anyway. I was like, Jesus Christ. Oh, that, that. You know what? For that question that you had, that's probably the worst thing a girl's probably said to me. I was like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is harsh. I was like, oh, I'm mad. And then I was like, but one nil doing it. But you still listen to Bashment doing it. But just tonight, Afrobeats is in right now. Just saying. Yeah, but that's anyway. basically Soka with, like. Definitely not Soka. Um. No. That's oh my days. African music. Swear down. That's how African music's been all the time. Right, really. Hundred percent. Word. No. Since back in the day. Word. Okay, because this Afrobeats didn't even count even ten years ago. This stuff only recently started. No. No, 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 All no, my no. music that we've been listening to in my mum's house and all of that from back in the day so it was, sounds similar to that. So bootleg soco. <laughs> <laughs> Get me. Pick up all the soco no. madam in the comments, innit? No. We're not, we're not, we're not letting this one go. Cameraman. No, 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 no. We're not letting <laughs> it go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Not letting that go. Sorry. You better let that go.
Let it go. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I don't think it's running things right now. It's fine. That's what I know. Because uh, as soon as I hear Chris Brown coming out of his Afrobeat uh, song, then I'll be like, Everyone's right, trying to jump on Afrobeats, let's just say. So, um. Oh, man. Yeah. Everybody needs that, that Caribbean song in their album. Uh uh. <laughs> Check every single album. Every single album. Every single. Every single album no, that comes out now. Save it. Afrobeats Listen, yeah, Chris Brown had how many, like, what, like, 70 songs in his album? I didn't, I didn't hear not one Afrobeats. Not one. Chris Brown, who else? Hmm?